Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green episode 10. And in this episode we're still on the SSN. Um Yeah 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 I know that's why I'm here to get cut from So in this episode we're actually still on the SSN. Uh we just be we're battling everybody on the ship while I'm giving you guys a little tour of the ship, allowing you guys to see what's out there. Allowing you guys to see what's out there so you guys can know how the SSN is or how it looks. I don't know. Maybe you guys have seen it before, maybe you've not. I don't know. I think they have another ship in um They have all different types of ship. I've gone on I've played a lot of Pokemon and I've gone on maybe all the ships except the one in the Univo region. I've 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 actually never played not really never played. I've played like the first Part, up to the first gym and then after that I stopped playing Pokemon Black um with me it was like a identity identity issue I guess uh, identity issue because with Pokemon Black um, and white I felt a little different it felt a little different and I know that's okay uh, uh, that's good I actually liked it how it was but I actually went down with how it looked the imagery of how it looked like I know, I know, no. Somebody wants, somebody's, somebody wants to get healed. I'm, I'm running, I'm running. You're gonna die. Please don't die. But anyways, guys, um, that was the port side. I don't even know. I, I, I was a poop. Uh, uh, what did they call the um, front of the de the, the ship? Isn't it called a poop deck? I don't even know. What, is, what do they call the front of a ship? Oh, let's see what's in here. This is the kitchen. Well, this is the kitchen And we just found a great ball nice Kid found one petra berry Kid found one cherry berry. Oh my gosh. I have berries. I forgot completely that they have berries now So that was the kitchen. So I think I've shown you guys like the bottom of the kitchen. Now and I'll show you guys the front of the ship, which is called the port. I'm, I I actually don't know. I'm just yeah. I I see it. I might need to get a flute to wake that bad boy up. But I won't add him to my team anyways. Nothing's wrong with Snorlax. It's just I don't think Snorlax would be. Pick for this team. What am I looking for to build this team? I'm actually looking for a lot of diverse Pokemon. Uh, when I say diverse, I mean like I'm looking for. I'm looking for like. I'm not saying one of every type. I I want the essential. The essential for me is always fire, water, grass, and a flying type. Like that's the essential. After that, after that, the other two Pokemon can be. I don't know. I don't really care what the other two Pokemon are. Um, actually, it's the first time I've seen a Pikachu on the ship. Finally, Diglett. Oh crap. I don't know what I just got, but all I know is that Diglett just fainted. So we'll be running back to the room, and I think somebody's poisoned. No? No one's poisoned? So yeah, I realized that this is my room. It's not necessarily my room. It's just this kind person who's willing to say, rest up here. A, B, C, D. 
Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, like, this one. Let's see, let's see, let's see, this one. I think we're out of battles right now. Yep, no we aren't. Let's speed this baby up. Again, I should teach. Why do you keep on doing this? I should teach Gyarados a water type move, but I'm hoping that he learns one or learn learns another move quickly so I can teach him a water type. I want to teach him a water type move. But I want to see what moves he learns first. Oh, nah, wrong Pokemon. Dang, Diglett, why did you have to get paralyzed? Uh, let's see where we were, where we're going next. Is anybody fainted? No, Diglett is just paralyzed though. So guys, I guess we're gonna fight our rival right about now. Um, I'll just do a couple things um, off camera for you guys, cause uh, um, so guys, um, we are back. Uh, what I did before, I, I, just, I just made a quick run back to get all these guys healed up, and I'll just switch out Pikachu to the front. Now we are gonna face our rival. Bonjour, kid. Imagine seeing you here, kid. Were you really invited? So how's your Pokedex coming out? I already caught 40 kinds, pal. Different kinds are everywhere. Call around the grassy areas and if you look hard enough. Hard. If you look hard for them. Uh, I suck at this voiceover thing. I, I shouldn't get a job. So he's gonna send out Pidgeotto first, and that's why I threw out Pikachu. I remembered what he did last fight, so I'm gonna see if my Thundershock. So my Pokemon are actually over the level. I, th I thought his Pidgeotto would have reached at least level like 25, well, 21. That's why all this time I was actually leveling up all my Pokemon, especially Pikachu. So I think this fight's gonna be real, real easy to um to get through. Uh, so he's gonna use Raticate next, so I'm gonna switch out Raticate that, and I'm gonna throw in Diglett. Again, he still has his four Pokemon, so I think there's a um, there's a difference now. His Raticate, I think he just caught that Raticate. Did he have that Raticate last time? That Raticate is level 16, so I thought though he would his Pokemon would be like. Wow. I swear like his Pokemon would be like top of the line right about now. Uh, okay, so he's using Hyper Fang. I'm using Dig. Uh, okay, let's see what else Pokemon is coming out. As I said before though, I think I think this is just this is just gonna be an easy win for me. Um he uses Kadabra. What Pokemon has a dark type move that I can manipulate? I think I'm. I think Gyarados. Gyarados doesn't have a water type move, so he's practically useless against Charmander or Charmeleon. I'm not even sure what level his Charmeleon is right about now. But the Abra that he had before it evolved. So let's see. Ah, the Sable. Ah. Dang it. Ah! Uh, use splash. Why? 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 Why was I making you use splash? Well, at least tackle works perfectly fine. 
As I said before, I, th I think my Pokemon might be overpowering his. That's the idea I'm getting right now. To the, to the fact that I'm capable of. I just got rid of like three of his Pokemon without sustaining any damage to mine. So that's where I'm getting this idea from. It's Charmeleon's at level 20. As you guys remember last time when we fought him in Cerulean City, um, we were underpowered though. He overpowered us a lot, and we 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 didn't even know what to do. I I, I remember we 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 were, we were lost. Like I think all hope was left on. Ivasaur is back and I should have used Gust. I forgot that he was inflicted by burn. Ah, don't worry. Um, all hope was on Ivasaur's back and I was... Ivasaur barely, barely went through. I think Ivasaur barely went through so I'm gonna use Dig right now. Let's see what's happening. Yes, and Dig was super effective. So. As I said before guys man, I think I might have overestimated him because of what happened in Cerulean City to the point where I overtrained my Pokemon. town map and what's this anyways let's see how this let's let's go help this captain guy um out by rubbing his back oh, oh, oh i feel hideous oh seasick kid rubs the captain's back rub 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 Whew. thank you i'm feeling much better now you want to see my head cut technique? I could show you my prize cut technique if I want, so we'll... I know, you can have this. This is the hidden machine cut. Teach cut to your Pokemon and you can see cut in any time. You can use cut any time. Yep, so I got the HM cut. Using cut you can chop down small trees. Why not try it from around Romerian City? Thank you, Captain. So the SSN will be setting sail soon. I hope you guys liked my little two episode tour I guess of the SSN of, of you know the different parts of it. You guys got to see the different rooms, you guys got to see the different that. Now we'll be leaving. So let's say goodbye to everybody. Bye. Get out of here. Bye. 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 They should have put a, like a function for you to at least wave. <laughs> I thought I could have ran back. But anyways guys, um, I think that's it for today's episode. We will be teaching Chatingy... Where's, 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 yeah. We'll be actually teaching cut to somebody. Uh, this is the first HM we got, and we'll be teaching it to Chading. Wow, did cut the line cut? Uh, maybe I should teach him now. Nah. We'll be teaching this to the Chading. Uh, let's get rid of Sand Attack. So we just teach Chiding Sand Attack. Um, this is an electric type gym, so I think the people who will be the most useful in this gym would be Diglett and Ivasaur. Um, let me know if I, I, I think would be Diglett and Ivasaur. Pikachu uh, would be like a substitute in between. That's what I'm guessing. So let's go sell something first. Sell. Sell this nugget. Nope. 
I just wanted to get rid of that and I get it off my hands. So that's it for today's episode, guys. Um, I'm realizing that I might be doing too much, um, not too much episode, but the fact that I'm trying to cut everything down to 60 minutes, and each most episodes are like the most I I view it as the most boring thing when we have to rush through like a hill of trainers non-stop. Um, so next episode we'll be challenging the Vermilion Gym. Is that the town we're in? I'm I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Yep, Vermilion City. So next episode we'll be challenging the Vermilion Gym leader. Um, we'll be seeing how it ends up, how it goes for us. Uh, I hope you guys continue to join me on this adventure. Um, again, uh, see you guys around and thank you for joining me on this adventure, guys. Uh, if you guys have any feedback or anything about like what Pokemon I should add to my team, I'm, as I said before, the essentials for me always grass, fire, water, and flying. I already have a flying type, I already have a grass, and I've just picked up my water type. Let me give. Let me get an idea about a fire type. Let me get an idea about what the other people two should be. Should I keep Pikachu? Should I not keep Pikachu? Should I get rid of most of the people? Or should I switch out? I mean, I have time. Maybe not, but we'll see. Uh, thank you guys and.